So now that I've modeled a fixture to hold our part, let's insert an appropriate CMM machine. I can do that by selecting Insert Hardware Definition Machine. Using the pull down at the top of the dialog, I can select any of the machines that are sold by Hexagon and some of our competitor machines as well. I'm going to choose a global 575 machine. So we can see that PCDMIS has now inserted a model of our machine inside the graphics display window. I'm going to go back into quick fixture mode and I'm going to choose the front view and I'm going to drag the part and the fixture down in the Z direction. So this is the side view of our part and fixture sitting on our coordinate measuring machine. I'm going to go into the top view now and I'm going to left mouse button drag and position this whole assembly towards the front of the machine. When I'm finished positioning the fixture and the part, I can simply exit out of quick fixture mode. If I select Edit, Preferences, Setup, and I select the Part slash Machine tab, you'll notice that PCDMIS, based on my mouse movements, has calculated the X, Y, and Z offsets for the part placement.